Hey guys, welcome back to some more System Shock 2. We are going to Command Control. What kind of interesting horrors wait, await us over here? A cutscene does. Oh god, no! Do you not trust the feelings of the flesh? Our biology yearns to join with yours. We welcome you to our mass. But you puzzle us. Why do you serve our mother? How can you choose cold metal for the splendor of flesh? But you fear us. We hear your thoughts, and they rage for your brothers you believe dead. But they are not. They swing in our symphony of life. We offer another chance to join us. If you choose to lie down with the machine, we will rend you apart and put you separate from the joy of the mass. Okay, uh, whatever. That, that part's kind of glitched, I think, in the good old games version. Oh well. Oh. My bad. I apparently hit that thing. They aren't making this easy for us, are they? I miss you. I know it's stupid, but I do. I think I'll wallow in self-pity for an hour or so, and then rate you again. Figures. I have to travel 67 trillion miles to meet a man. Once you're transferred to the Von Braun, everything will be better. I'll be better. I promise. Great. Someone's coming. Counting the seconds. So one of the things I got was a version 1 repairing software. There's, there's software for all the tech abilities. And that just simply makes it either faster or easier or whatever. So you, throughout the game, you actually get better at those kinds of things. Also, that monkey had chips. I love that monkey. Oh. I wasn't ready for that. We have to wait for him now to finish up. A lot of dead people. Alright. And go. Nothing up here, I think. Okay, well, we're gonna hop over here. I'm actually going to have my hazard suit. And I'm gonna have cryokinesis. And there's two good reasons for this. And now I'm not radiated. Oh. Fuck! Uh, okay. So, uh, you notice how I didn't get the, uh, the cryo thing? It just knocks me back to the menu, which means I have to use my, my quick save. Which is right here, luckily. Um, I... Yeah, see, they, they, he spawns behind me on purpose. Alright, let's let the radiation finish up. It's the whole reason I have the suit, I have so much inventory space. That I can I can spare it. And uh, there's one more. I unfortunately uh, I let it overcharge, and that's actually one of the disadvantages. But I can hit that guy, which is nice. Alright, let's try let's try this one more time. Okay, now I got my sigh. And now I got it. One hit. monkey right here. We're having like a psi war. Who let all these psi monkeys free? Alright. Well, we got that, and we got that, and we're good. Okay. Do not hide forever. Yeah, I'm not coming down there, so... This guy can go fuck himself. <laughs> Alright, we can get some liquor, uh, some PDA, so let's get the PDA out. I mean it. This isn't something you can fight. This isn't something you can run from. 
If you love me, you won't come looking for me. Just hang tight. I won't let you down. There's a, there's a huge love story going on here. And he, he apparently took the time to go and uh, record a bunch of logs for this. As I said, similar to how Bioshock uh, told its story. Uh, you know, it's it's obviously inspired from, except way more casualized. You notice this is probably a lot more difficult. Which makes it better. I don't know. Alright. Let's go up the little grav shaft here. And there's a little control panel here and like some other weird stuff, but we're actually going to go up here. I haven't used that. I know I haven't used that pyrokinesis thing yet, and I will be using it shortly. Uh, it's just for the... Not me. No way. They're not going to get me. They're not going to change me. Rachel, kids, I'm sorry. Question, my question is, is that me? Because that's how I look. Okay, hi. Oh, uh, you're coming for me? Alright, let's get eat some stuff. There's a camera somewhere over there. Sorry. Let's if I can run and get this camera. We... And now we get our uh, our uh, quantum rebio construction in the bob. Right, let's go loot these guys before they disappear. They are loaded. All right, and so we got some stats or some tech. Uh, I want to get research, but I can't do that at the moment, so it just, it just ain't happening. Unless somebody's nice enough to have some uh, buy whatever the thing is. My duty is to the UNN and to this ship, but can I resist the call of the many? My father's weakness brought Shodan into existence. My weakness has invited these things aboard the Von Braun. Can I undo the wrong I have done? That's that's the hacker that that killed Shodan the first time. Oh, Shodan. We keep talking about Shodan, but we actually haven't seen Shodan yet, which is which is interesting. Take that as you will. All right. Now for arguably the hardest p part in this entire run is this area. You guys are gonna have fun watching me do this. Uh, guess I can't get through this one right now. Okay. Okay. So I can't go can't go this way yet. So I'll have to go this way. This is gonna be horrible. Wait, I don't have cargo bay access. Hold up a moment. Where am I supposed to be? Uh, is it in cargo bay two? Uh, I missed the tape somewhere. I'm gonna. Uh, I missed the access code somewhere, so I'm gonna try and find it. So I'll, I'll be back in a sec. Uh, sorry guys, I I goofed. Uh, you're not actually supposed to have that card. Um, the thing is, I only looked at this bay, and I'm like, oh, I can't go through here, but actually what it's telling me is it's busted, and I can get in. Go me. This is Xerxes. Can you not feel the glory of the flesh? Do you not yearn to be free of the tyranny of the individual? Okay, we need our agility back. So this is this is gonna be one of the hardest Please parts of this game, selection. and it's gonna be horrible. I wish I could kill these guys in two hits. Oh, I don't need liquor. Get out of here. Drinking is a bad habit, kids. Not really. I love drinking. All right. This is the biggest problem. Alright, so this is what I'm going to do. I'm going to use localized pyrokinesis field. I can't get hurt by them! Hi! Hi! <laughs> this now just turned fun. <laughs> and so I, I just set everything on fire around me. I'm a, I'm a, I'm a, I can W mouse 1 basically the W mouse 1 guys. Uh oh. And I died. That, that turret W-mouse won me. Alright, let me get back there then. 
Okay, I'm back in the room, and I don't really see a point in going back up there because I, I simply am not equipped to deal with him uh, at the moment. And I know it's really dark here, and you have to just bear with me. It, it is a really dark game because it's racist. I don't know. But we have our key card here, which is nice. I don't know if this is a glitch or something, but it's it's good fucking saving my life. Although it's really hard to, to be stealthy when when I have this on. Let's go kill this bot. Like a badass. I might as well make use of this pyrokinetic field or whatever. Whoops. Uh, okay, I didn't really mean to use that. Oh, I'm running out. There we go, we got him. And more often than not, he'll drop something. This is why I hate these guys, because I have to melee them. There's there's no question about it. They have to be melayed if I if I want to deal with them. Or I could just ignore them. Pick one. Now I think I actually don't have enough points for this. There we go. See, I don't like being near these cargo containers, because they blow up into those guys. No, now, now these guys just became fun. Hey. Hey. Call of Duty. The best ability. Guy is running around. I might as well make the most of this, the most of this thing that I have here. Oh, nobody else is around. I'm sad. Uh, that's why I'm just running through it, because I'm just like, hey, I got pyrokinesis, I might as well. And so that's going to be my ace in the hole when it comes to dealing with uh, those guys, which is lucky for me doing a, a side melee run that they become very easy to ha take care of. I hear monkeys. Mike stalks his monkey prey. Ooh, there's a locked box here, which I never got. Probably getting some cybernetic affinity would be in, in good in question. It's useful, it really is. Those fucking monkeys, I... They're the worst! Okay. I'm gonna be like, stalking them. Da -na -na -na. Monkeys. Come to me, monkeys. I will not bite. Hi! Surprise. I still hear them. Oh, they're probably on another floor. You see what I did to your monkey friend there? Same's gonna happen to you. Oh, damn it! Damn it! Get out of here. Abort! Abort the mission! There's too many of them! It's just one monkey. It's, I don't care! One is too many! Oh wow, I can I can I can kill them in one hit now. Ooh. Uh oh, wait. No, that's I've already been there, I think. Yeah, I have. It's like the park going on boxes part. Damn it. Let me get up here. There we are. They make those noises to make you fear them. I'm honestly going to be traumatized. I'm never going to go to a zoo again. That's what the monkeys do to you. Okay, well, he's dead. Alright, young viewers, you can watch the screen again. The monkeys are dead. I wonder if there's like a phobia of monkeys you can have. Okay, nothing up here. Just kind of exploring every little nook and cranny. Yeah. Mostly because I, I probably didn't check these boxes as well as I could have the previous times I played this game. Alright, which way are we going? We are going back the other way. Alright. Another one here. He's in the corner here, you see? He's a stealth monkey. Stealth monkeys are the worst kind of monkeys. 
laboratory worker from MedSci called me down to the vivisection room yesterday. He felt the lab chimps were exhibiting uncommon intelligence. I sat with one for four hours and tried to probe it with the Psyamp on a Beta-4 cycle. It failed to respond. I, of course, assumed it was because it was incapable of reacting to the sophisticated Beta-4 cycle. But then, I realized it was blocking the probe intentionally. As soon as I raised the Psyamp to attack it, the creature lashed out with its arms and projected a cryokinetic field towards me, paralyzing my arm. I immediately side dampened the monkey and then stunned it with an electric prod. Yeah, those monkeys, man. There we go. Now, now I am the monkey hunter. The hunter have become the hunty. I don't know. <laughs> Fuck! I hate them! At least I killed them in one hit now. It was bad when I couldn't do that. I I hear him like right next to me. It's creeping me the shit out. Where are you? So if you not notice there was a security station there uh, a little bit earlier I was looking at it. I wonder, can I get over there? Is like an MLG jump? No. I, I want to get up there. I think I may have to like fucking monkey. You know, it's like it's it's the worst thing because you're like you're you're probably laughing at this because it's like like oh it's just a fucking monkey, Mike. Don't worry about it. And I'm, I'm like no, it, they're not just monkeys. They're the worst thing. Damn. I think I can make that. I, I honestly want to try. Oh yeah. Is, it, is that a place I can't get out of? No, I'm trapped in here forever. I was not supposed to get here. I actually found a I actually found a way to get stuck. That's that's great. All right, well, time to go back up. So I hope you're finding this this run to be a lot more thorough than my last one. Uh, even though I'm doing a similar setup, I'm I, as I said, I'm not going into weapons at all, and I'm finding I find I find it to be actually a lot of fun just to. You know, be a Malay monster. And, and there's challenges involved with like the robots and stuff, but you know, as I said, there's a ways around it, which is nice. I, I, don't, I don't know if it was intentional or like a glitch, but either way, it's a lifesaver because otherwise, like, the robots just chase after you and blow up, and that's it. They're, they're really goddamn annoying, so, you know, having, having that extra option is actually really nice. Alright, so we're gonna hack this guy. Nanites. I have plenty of nanites, so I could just I could do this all day. Fortunately, the difficulty is still like 70%, really. <laughs> there we go. Security system offline. So now we can actually go up into that where that turret is. And he will not be a problem anymore. This was not the proper area. My mistake. Oh, that's right. I just skipped him when when he gave me trouble, and so I went to the next area. Cool. I can be over here. No, I'd want to be. I can just go like I was just kind of jumping into the parkouring into these interesting places. Also, if you didn't notice, I picked up a swift boost uh, module, which is um. Let me eat this crap. Uh, that will raise my agility by one. Well, I'm not using it is because I'm finding strength to be more important right now. I thought the turret was here. Okay, I, I, apparently I super skipped it. Yeah, I have no re recollection of where it actually was. Um, so, uh, let's just forget about it. Maybe it's over here. Actually, yeah, it was probably over here. Because I remember I was already here. My bad. You can blame me later. Having security offline is, really helps though. Here we go. Oh, I don't know why that freaks me out. I'm like, I know he can't hurt me. Actually, I don't really need to hurt this control this guy. No wall this. Oh, that's nice. Alright, well, I'll just casually go hack this. Excuse me, I'm hacking! 
Jesus, they're so inconsiderate. The guy just can't hack in peace anymore. Yeah, it's like... The, the, the game is like really hard now. Look at that. I, I just kind of have to go until I roll one that actually works. Damn. This is with... Oh, I don't even have the, the thing on. There we go. Now we have it on. There, that, that made it easy. See, that's why I have that. It, it, it just it makes it doable. Okay, I think we're done with this area. So, I'm going to parkour up here. Alright, what do I have in terms of cyber modules? 18. Okay, we're, we'll do that then. Uh, the thing I'm thinking about right now, which is a secret, I'll tell you later. No, I'll tell you now. Remember that, remember that research thing I was planning on getting? I'll get it now. You, you can hear them blowing up. And my agility deactivated, that's okay. Do you notice the difference in speed? Like, it's just like, now I feel like a slug. And what, one of my powers got drained, that's okay. We'll, uh, we'll hop over to the... the the other, whatever, the, there's a recharger nearby, so I don't have to worry too much about it. Alright. So over here, I had the ability to pick... N I did not have the... Oh, wait, wait, no, no, I have the ability to pick tech. I get research module? Okay, so I have my research now. And, uh, how many modules? I have one module left. So, but basically there's all this crap here, like this. Uh, not gonna do that one. Uh, let's do something... Yeah, see, this one doesn't require any research, and it actually goes really fast. So, you know, I can just walk around in the meantime. Uh, this is essentially how the research works. If I have more points today, it'll go faster. I'm, I'm gonna put one more point into it, and that's actually because the melee weapon I want to use actually has that. Uh, it requires four research points. That's the only reason you'd want to get, ever get more than one point to research. If you're doing, like, guns and stuff, you don't really need it. We got this. You can go, like, check the progress on the research. It's, it's fast enough. I, I, I don't have to, to stop. The, the, oh, well, as I said, we can walk around while it's going on, so we don't really have to care. And it's almost complete. And there you go. It's done. Complete. So we can also right-click the object, and it's a hybrid organ, which is the hybrids which I'm killing. And all damage it will be increased by 25%. And it gives me a rough little uh, uh, summary here of uh, what, how they work, which is kind of interesting. They tell me, how, and they usually tell you how best to kill it. So, so they're if, it, uh, basically anti-personnel rounds are effective against them. I can just throw that on the floor, and that's it. So that's it for this episode. Uh, next time we'll go into Cargo Bay Two. I'll see you later. Bye.